It's iRacing, it's Le Mans, it's the VRS Global Endurance Series. Welcome to the best endurance race in the world, the VRS Global Endurance 24 Hours of Le Mans. It's been free practice all week and we've been checking out the drivers such as Sven Haas and Jaden Laddick taking to the track as their teams try to prepare their setups, find all the pace on the track, work out their strategies. What are they doing with those tyres? Double, quad or, well, in between, triple stints. And what are they doing about fuel? Marvin Strell starting off nice and early with pretty quick times, but unfortunately at the exit of Sector 1, he just took a bit too much grass and decided to toast his tyres on the exit. Lottimer Wing in action with Hugo, taking to the Moltan straight, taking all the top speed, hitting the cone on entry into the chicane, and flying out with some very competitive lap times. It's not just been GTE traffic, unfortunately, though, but it has just been the Corvette GTE. Pablo coming into the track and setting some pretty competitive times, but... It's just been all Corvettes, unfortunately. It seems to be the car of go-to choice with Luke McEwen from Alter C Sports driving this weekend for Rick Energy. There was one Porsche GTE, but I don't think that's going to be the car of choice. It's going to be a Corvette field, an Audi field for the LMP1 and the Dallara P217 for the LMP2s. We had teams testing out their top speed in the draft, making sure their sixth gear doesn't hit the limiter or just give them complete and total kaput engines. Ryan Barnevold setting really competitive lap times, having a great battle with Marvin Strell of Rick Energy to see who is the quickest on track. But it doesn't matter now. All that matters is the race. So it's iRacing. It's Le Mans. It's the VRS Global Endurance Series, the 24 hours of Le Mans. And it takes place tonight at 18 GMT.